Hello, Pokemon Go fans. We are going to do a really kind of a strange raid here. So, it, it begins with uh, uh, a few minutes ago in a park far, far away. This is the story of Staryu Raids. Yes, we're going to do a Staryu raid. I've been clicking on Staryus every time I see one on the map. Even if I'm driving. Oh my god, don't Pokemon and drive. And I do not have the shiny yet, so this is a really good opportunity to get a shiny Staryu. The best odds are three gyms. So, let's see what we can do. I mean, obviously, I probably shouldn't record this, but I want to I wanna record it just to see if we get some sparks. Let's see that shiny. Come on. All right. It's going to be good stats. It might be worth keeping. And then, of course, there's the Stardust and the XP. Yeah, I mean, it's a one-star raid. I think anybody can take these down, no matter what level you are, by yourself. So, or, or two beginners can, uh, can definitely take one of these guys down. Any one-star raid. So, you want, you want 3,000 XP and 1,000 Stardust and some, some other little rewards... Go for it. Go for it. All right. Just make sure you're stocked up. Oh, it's not shiny. It is not shiny. All right. Well, let's go ahead and zap him in the ball there. Let's see what our stats look like at least. Well, he says. All right. That's two. Wow. Dude is a little testy. Let's see. Alright, let's give him that. And do your thing. And let's see if we... Oh. That's one. That's two. That's three. Wow, okay. I'm impressed. I thought he'd go down on the first ball. All right, 648. Let's see, is it any good? That's 15 attack, 15 defense. Oh, no, I'm sorry, 15 HP. 10, hmm, hmm. Well, we'll have to check that one out. Ball toy, that's another one. I do not have the shiny yet. Would like to get it. Would like to get it. Look at these guys. Yeah. He's like, ha ha, stole your Pokeball. Stole it. Alright, we have 18 minutes to go on a Deoxys raid. Deoxys raid. But we're looking at the park in Kenner. And everybody knows by now on my feed or my videos that... What? Let me hear you. I can't hear you. Um, let me hear it. That's right. Nobody raids in Kenner. Nobody raids in... in well, this part of Kenner. This is what I mean by nobody raids in Kenner. Okay? Everybody raids at the far end of Kenner where Kenner meets Metairie. Everybody raids there. This is deep Kenner. This is the armpit of Kenner. Ooh, smell that? Uh, so anyway, um, yes. Nobody raids out here except me and Miss Lily. And lately... Um, even with my raid invites, 
Um, I do not have very many friends that come and want to uh, help me out. I am always there when when they need me. So, I don't know. It is what it is. It's Pokemon Go. It's a game. But, anyway. Um, I don't think we're going to hang out for... Well, I don't know. Unless I can... Let's do a let's do a couple of uh, checks on Ghost Stadium. All right. So did everybody watch my video about uh, Sableye Spotlight Hour? Huh? Huh? You're gonna have to go look at that one. Uh, you're gonna have to go look at that one. All right. So let's. Oh, my computer's gotta do. All right, we're at 100%. Okay, had to do the update yesterday. All right, here we go. We're ready. Da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. All right, come on. Hello. There you go. All right, we're in. We're in. Okay. Stadium. Where's my shirt? All right, Zoe Two Dots just spent a million Stardust on a trade. That's crazy. Hope it was good. All right, so we're looking at Star Me because you're not going to raid with Star You. You're going to battle with Star Me. That's the evolution. All right, so let's see. We were 15, 10, 15. Uh, inside each one of those little uh, segmented lines is five little little uh, dots, basically. And when they fill up each one of those little segments, that uh, that's five. So you get five, ten, fifteen per line of attack, per line of defense, and per line of HP. So that's how you figure that. So... Uh, so when the bar is fully closed, you got 15, and when you're fully closed on two of them, but not the third one, that's 10, and so on. Um, and then you can, you can start to gauge, um, 11s and 12s and 13s and 14s. You'll, you'll definitely see that. Alright, so this was a raid boss. Uh, let's check it in Great League. In Great League, this is a 94%. Perfect, uh, for Great League, uh, stats, you're looking for 10, 14, 12. Alright, so if we were to bump this up to Ultra League. Ultra League, this is a 97%. And perfect for Ultra League is 10, 14, 14. All right, so do we move it up to uh, Master League? No, because Master League, a perfect IV set is 15, 15, 15. So this is best a 97 for Ultra League. Okay, so I may or may not keep that. Let's go ahead and check our other stars. Okay, so right now I am holding on to a 98. But you can definitely see that the 97 is a higher, higher CP. So, so that higher, or the higher... 98% is going to take a lot more candy to get that one up to, yep, it's got a lot, a lot higher CP, right. combat power, alright, let's go and check this dude out, alright, this is a regular catch, so you go wild catch, and that is a 10, 
This could be good, y'all. 13. This is definitely going to be good. 14. This is definitely going to be good. This is Great League written all over it. Now, Ultra League. Ultra League. Okay, now the stats change because this is just a wild catch. All right, so perfect stats for Great League. That's the lowest uh, tier. Is 0, 15, 11. Okay, and for Ultra League, second stage, best IVs are 7, 15, 15. So our guy right here is still a 98.9% with a rank of 32. So this guy, 98, rank 32. Can we fit? Yeah, we can. Okay, there you go. So that's what all of that means. All right, let's see what you got. Mm, it's a three-star. Uh, that is a 13 on the attack. That is a 13 on the defense, and that is an 11. Now, you see what I can, you see how you can tell? It's just, just like one little notch over the 10, so that's your 11. Okay, and obviously it's not going to be good for Great League. And this is a wild catch, right? Yes, wild catch. Okay, uh, Ultra League, this is a 97.99 with a rank of 154. Master League, it drops down to a 95 because obviously in Master League, the perfect is a 15, 15, 15. So, he's not quite there. So this is our 97%. We're just going to call this a 99. Okay, it doesn't get any closer than that. So we're going to call it a 98. I'm sorry, I said a 99, didn't I? So we're going to go 98. I'm not going to put that high rank in there. But that is Ultra League. Okay. Uh, this was a research guy. And I know that because as soon as I pull them out of one of the research things, I put the little R there. So there you go. That's what we're looking at for Star Mies. Okay. Um, so let's see. We have a bunch of 98s. So we don't need to keep this 97. Nobody's going to want to trade me for a Star, star U. Okay, so then we start to go looking at um, our little 98.32 is going to take a lot of stardust and a lot. Let me just show you. Let me just show you what we're looking at. All right, so let me retype this dude in there to give you an idea. All right, so we said this was for Ultra League. And that this dude was our wild catch. All right, so this was our 10, 13, 14. This is the one we thought was going to be great. All right, so he's a 98.9 with a rank of 32. Now, to max him out... Well, we get, first off, to get him to Ultra League, we have to get him over 1,500 CP. And it may not happen. He may max out. We may have to uh, technically evolve him. All right. Jeez, I'm All right, so, well, da, 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 50 candy, and, uh, all right, let me, let me just evolve this dude, just in case you've never seen this evolution. Here he goes. All right, and then, uh, regardless, we'll see what's, uh, what's going on. The, uh, IVs or the stats are not going to change. 
They only do that for uh, purifying shadow Pokemon. Okay, so there is Starmie. Okay, and remember these stats do not change. I am not lying. Okay, all right, so he bumps up to a 413. All right, so to get him to 1500 or just below... Let me just check something here. Yeah, okay, so we're on, on point. Okay, so just to make sure that you haven't, uh, like, miscounted or, or mistaken your research for, like, oh, shoot, I forgot to put a research on it. You can go to Go Stadium Club, and you can now, you know, well, we're not going to power him up yet, but you can use this little, uh, don't don't hit the power up button when you're when you're playing with the stats like this. Not until you're sure you really want to do it. Um, so then you can go to GoStadiumClub.com and you pump him up just to where you know anything 1500 or better is going to move you up to Ultra League. And right then it'll tell you, okay, so he will max out before going over 1500 at 1468. Then you plug those numbers into Go Stadium Club under Star Me. And it will tell you the maxed out CP for that. And I'm looking at on the, on the, uh, let's see, let me show you. All right, so we're looking at 1468, right? So let me, let me just show you here real quick. Bump it, bump it, bum. And there it is. See? Max CP 1468. So that matches. So. If, if I were really mistaken, you can go down to research, go to here, click that, because that's Great League, Ultra League, and Master League. So there you go. So, let me hit the button there. And, well, oops, it doesn't change. So it doesn't matter if this particular Pokemon is in Ultra League, or I'm sorry, a Research, or apparently an Egg Hatch. He's a strange. He's a strange bird. All right. Normally, normally, and I will show you. Normally, that is definitely a big difference. So anyway, back to our back to our dude here. All right, so you can see that I have 880 candy. The stardust is not the problem, although it still is for some people. All right, so 1468. So if we want to get this guy into Ultra League, we have to go there. So it's going to cost you 46,400 stardust. All right, test to get him to 1504. Now maxed out in Ultra League. This is for this is for you know maximum effectiveness. You would have to move him to 2489. Okay, 2489. Otherwise, it goes over 2500, and that much moves you up to Master League. Okay. So now you're looking at 256,400 stardust. That's a lot of stardust. And 279 candies. So let's take our other guy. Uh, I'm not going to evolve all of these up. But you can clearly see that we evolved that one. And it max and its uh, CP ended up being 413, which is already the same CP of our dude right here. Huh? Let's do it. Let me let me just let me just prove the prove the point. All right, so let's evolve this dude. Okay, so he's at 413, whereas we had to evolve the other guy up to 413. So this guy, 
da -da. He will go up to like seven something or other. Nope, 935. That's a lot closer to the uh, the 1500, right? Okay, so. So to get him up. Bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum, ba bum Would only cost you 32 candies and 32,000 Stardust 800. 32,800. Otherwise, the other guy was, what, 46? So there you go. So it definitely saves time and Stardust and all of that good stuff. So I am going to delete this guy. I'm going to delete this one. Because I don't need this many star starmies. Uh, I, I don't battle with them. As far as I know, they're not really PvP relevant. Um, so, da, 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 da. we're going to go and get rid of this one as well. I'm only going to keep two of these, guys. Yeah, I'm only going to keep two of these. I don't even know why I'm keeping that many. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. Right, that's what he was looking at here. Yeah, see, so that one's really good. Let me replug this guy in here. Let's, this looks pretty good for maybe Master League. Let's see. So that is a 13. 14 you can see the difference now 15 it's a 13 14 15 how about that okay and what was he as far as we know he was a regular catch okay so in Wow, okay, so... Yeah, see, I, I did this one a, a while back. Gee whiz. This dude is a 98... with a rank of 26 in Great League. Seriously? Wow. Ultra League, he's a 99. Boy, I, I really messed this one up, huh? I must have looked it up as a star you. Yeah, so this is a 98, oh, I'm sorry, 99 in Ultra League. Uh, 90, 99 in Ultra League. Hmm, let's go ahead and evolve this guy. Let's evolve this one. And maybe this will be my keeper. This will be my keeper. Yeah, there's so many other better water Pokemon. That's, that's why they don't really consider this guy to be uh, battle uh, battle relevant. So there you go. He's going to be 122. Whoops. That's not what I meant to do. And to get him over 1,500... It's only going to be 29. Okay. Better than better than 32, right? Okay. And to max it out to 2,500. Is going to run us. Boom. 230 candy. 220,600 stardust. Okay. It's not worth my effort to do that right now. So what I would probably do, if I wanted to battle with him, I would go ahead and, and bump him up. So, we don't need this guy. Let's delete him, get us an extra candy. And... We'll delete him. 
okay and I will hang on to those so now I have a 98 and a 99 and the 98 is going to cost less stardust and less candy to uh, max him out for that particular now how are we doing uh oh we missed the start of let's see is anybody there did i miss it i've only missed two minutes of it so we should be good okay so let's see whoops i gotta go buy some more remote passes i speak of our buddy here not shiny okay I probably should be using pineapps on him, but I'm saving pineapps for more relevant uh, Pokemon. Alright, so we need zeros. That's pretty close, but not really strong enough on the HP and defense. So we will go ahead and transfer that one. Alright, so I need to go and buy some raid passes i need to go pop into some more gems so i can get some more poke coins okay all right now let's see is miss lily gonna show up and help us out we uh miss lily and i are not friends on pokemon go so let me see if i have enough friends online okay so let's see, Smart Andrew, Katie, just not going to have enough people online to invite, well at least that they're saying they're online, wait what was that, what was that, what was that, Matt Bryce, Katie May, it's only three friends. It's only three friends. All right, well, if they show up, four people can easily take this down. Let's see. We will sit in here until the last 10 or 12 seconds, and then if nobody shows up, you, you quit, and you get to keep your pass. Let's see. Does anybody need a shiny Deoxys? Doom, 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 doom. Is anybody out there? Remembering that no one raids in Kenner. Now, today is Wednesday. Am I right? Yes, today is Wednesday. So it's possible that everybody is saving their passes until 6 p.m. because at 6 p.m. it is raid hour more than likely that's what's going on more than likely that's what's going on that's why nobody is battling right now so looks like i'm gonna have to go get me some uh some food and then i will probably head on out to the park on the other side of town and uh yeah do that so there it is oh let me show you for people who don't know maybe weren't aware of the update on how to toggle your your on and off button uh, to let them know that you're online and hey, I'm ready to help you with raids Okay, so right up at the top left hand corner underneath the little time stamp You'll see your your little buddy's uh, things His your little face, okay, so you, you see the little no notifications so right now See that that shows when it's in the far left position that shows that you are offline. See, and it shows up offline. Okay. 
So anytime, if I don't want to be found, if I if if I think I'm thinking that's a lot of what my my friend, the people on my friends list is, they don't want people to know that they're online for some reason. But anyway, I would like to know that every time I have the game on, I am ready for anyone to send me a raid invite, and I will be there unless I'm, you know really for some life-threatening or, uh, you know, some life um, thing that's going on in my life, I am usually there to, uh, to help in raids. So there you go. So that's how to toggle, they call that toggling, uh, your online status. Mine stays on all the time. But in case you're like, oh my gosh, I had no idea. Well, there you go. That Now you know. So, I would love to invite more people to my raids, especially in my area. Um, and I would love to be invited to yours. So, there you go. You need help with a two-star raid or something really cool. Especially, I would love to be invited to the unknown raids. Those are only two stars. I would love to be invited to every timber raid you come across. He's a one star. It doesn't matter. You know what? I like playing the game. I will battle any, any raid boss. One, two, three, four, or five star. It doesn't matter. Invite me. And especially if it helps you out. Like, oh, I don't think I can take down this, this two star or this three star by myself. Invite me. Two people can definitely take down a three star or a two star. Most definitely. You probably need about three people. Uh, depending on what your what your trainer level is, uh, you probably need uh, if you're low trainer level, you probably need four people for a um, a four star. But anyway, you saw that's what happens is then you go to your friends list. Okay, you go to your friends list, and you can you can toggle this little button down here on the far bottom right, and you can click online. So any of my friends that are online. Let's hit that again. Hello. Hello. There you go. All right. So anybody that has an online status will have that little... Uh, I'm colorblind, so I don't know if that's a green dot or a red dot next to their head. Okay. Not their little hearts and not those little arrows. Those little arrows mean that I sent them... A gift for the day already. It'll be that little pink, red. There you go. See, Nat, Natty, Natty B L C E has has that dot next to her head. That means she is online and accepting trade uh, or uh, accepting raid invites. Okay, and so is Metal. I don't know why it's not supposed to bring them up to the top there you go now it works all right so there you go there's my my only two people out of 54 people that are online playing are you all right no there's there's no way there's no way most of those people don't want to you know they i don't know they have their reasons so let's go back to this and i'm gonna hang in here just in case miss lily shows up so, all right, I am going to leave you. I'll you uh, leave you. I will here, and uh, yep. So, um, I I would love to do a video of uh of the raid hour, but there's just so many people out there, and they 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 all want to communicate with you. They all want to talk with you. So, I'll try. I'll try. There's a lot of people there, and I'll have my mask on. That's the other thing. You know, I, I don't know. I'll try. I'll try. But you get a lot of people talking back and forth to you. So, but anyway, I usually do about eight raids. So, all right, we'll give it a shot. We'll give it a shot. So, anyway, this was a little learning video. I hope you learned something about the raid invites, and I hope a, a little bit more about the... Uh, the uh, IV and uh, stat system. So there you go. So until our next video, 
Kid Eric is out.